Okay, so this is my how to build a basic house. I'm thinking I should build it in the village. So this is in 1.8 and they have all that stuff. And yeah, they added the Guardian. And it's pretty, I, I like Minecraft. I haven't played in a while, but three months ago. And I have a resource pack that I'm going to update so I can show you like all the all the builds in this research pack. So I'm thinking of building a basic house and hold on. Uh, water. S such a great thing. Anyways, so I'm thinking of building a basic house with like a ru like a rubbish and terrible path and a bit of brick. Not stone brick, just normal brick. I think that'd be a probably not I probably I think that'd be a pretty darn good idea. Reason being is you don't really see too many houses out of brick in Minecraft, not in real life. So I'm gonna build it over there in the village to add some like you know maybe some diversity to the village, make it look nice, stuff like that. Black spike. Okay, so crossing some pigs here in the village, and right here, perfect spot because there's nothing, nobody has built anything over here. So just start off with a few brick slabs. There we go. And start off with that. So there's our brick slabs. And now we're going to do the same thing over here. And I do mess up, but I at least cast that. So that's good. Now we're going to start on the sort of structure. And what we're going to do is now I'm going to put some gravel in. So gravel goes right there, and this is just going to be a quick how to build, and then I'm going to put some cobblestone and like some uh. cobblestone slabs and stairs to make it look a bit uneven, or like broken. Uh. Just like that, like that, and then like that. Uh. So there we are, sorry for the silence, and now we shall start on the house. So spruce is going to go along that way, and just up like that, then we're going to have it also go along this way, and just up like that, sorry I breathed into the mic, and just keep going up like that, don't fill those up with the spruce wood, and I did parkour just to make it look cool, but you don't have to, so it looks very nice to me. Anyways, so now what we'll do is we'll put that there, and we'll put that there, and now we will... I feel like adding some little, like, plants, but what I'll do is I'll grab some brick stairs, sorry about that, and I'll place that, and I'll place that. And yes, this is an even, and this is an after recording, so... Hmm. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a flower pot, and... This is where I know where the slabs are uneven. Because I take the flower pots and I don't place them down there. I put them on the sides right here and then I place the stuff. Not stuff, sorry. My stuff in them. And then I take that and a blue orchid and I place this down. And I look over here and I notice that, oh wait, I did something wrong. Da -da -da -da. Yes, I did something completely terribly wrong. So that works now, and there's the cacti, and here's the blue orchid. I breathe into the mic again, stupid me. So we're going to use some light gray glass. Uh, you can use any glass of your color, just don't make it like neon green. Well, not light gray, just gray. Just It's gray. Yeah, that's it. And so once we're done with that, we're going to start working on the actual house. So that's just like the front of the house. And we're going to put some brick in there. And finally, we're not done, I lied. But we're going to do some stuff with banners later and armor stands and stuff. And now we're just going to keep like the frame of the house going and just go like that. And go this way. Wrong part. Frame of the house. And you just go like that. I know I placed some logs oddly. And we gotta fix them. And I'm 
decent Minecraft builder. I wouldn't say I'm good. I would say I'm decent. And I'm going to do stuff like just normal Minecraft, no mods, vanilla. And then I'm going to have a modded Minecraft Let's Build. And the modded Minecraft Let's Build, for me, is going to be really fun because I, well, going to get to do a lot of stuff. And I put brick up there. You don't have to. Well, actually, I switch it for logs. So I put log. Sorry. Uh, I put brick up there. You can just put, like, solid logs. But I kind of, like, later I'm going to switch it to brick. I, I like the brick more, personally. So, yeah. The brick's just more, to me, favorable. I don't know why. So, n yeah, now I have to go in and change it. And this house, it wasn't, like, planned out, so it wasn't like, oh, yeah, I know what I'm doing. No, I was I was plan doing stuff as I went, so, yeah. This kind of, that that's why this is 20 minutes to build a house. And then, yeah, here I start switching it to brick. And as we go here, by the way, I'm going to upload this video tomorrow, which will be Saturday, November 1st. So pretty much it's going to be t tomorrow, November 1st. But there are going to be no videos tomorrow because I have family coming over. And they're younger than me by a few years. So I'm going to have to entertain my guests and do stuff with them. What stuff? I have no idea. They uh. like Lego, so I guess I'll, I'll, I'll probably do that. And they, I have Nerf guns and stuff. Anyways. That I never use anymore. So point. Back to the point. So we finished that. I've done the brick. And now I'm scrolling through things. Yeah. No. I start the main room for the whoever's building the house. In this case, me. Or you. If you were following this building. I don't know. I'm lost for words. I'm dumbstruck. Sort of. Not really. Point is, I'm a little bit talkative. Mainly because I had like two... I had, like, two, I don't know why, I had two, like, glasses of M&Ms. I don't know who does that. I do, apparently. Yeah, so, point is, um, now I'm just going to do the walls. I'm a bit talkative, more than usual. And now, just like that, and like that. And... I don't expect this to be like, oh my gosh, this is such an awesome build, build it through. What the heck was I trying to say? Awesome. Awesome tutorial on something to build. Wow, that took a lot while to get. No, this is just like, I think this looks cool. I've seen people who could probably do it like way better than me, but I think it looks nice. And I may do something with like quartz soon. So I'm thinking about doing quartz. Now, this is where sometimes I like optifying, because if you can see where like, the blocks split in this andesite, I believe this is andesite. If you can see where those blocks split, I kind of like not having that. So, I shall pause it soon, because, yeah, just to show you why it's nice to have optifying. There. So, you, I hope you can now see my mouse. Anyways. What the heck just happened? Okay, sorry. Okay, it's all good. So right there. See, I hope you can see. If you can't see my mouse, it's where the cursor is. The in-game cursor, like the cross hatching. Though, in Optifine, I believe that would just be like one solid texture, and then it would stop at the border of another solid block. And back to, the, back to your regu regularly scheduled program. And there may not be black bars on the side. I don't know. So I thought spruce doors would go good there. And now I'm going to do jungle wood. And I realize, oh, jeez, that doesn't fit. I don't know why I broke the doors. But I'm just going to go for split doing it differently. And then just popping that in. Because, hey, it looks nice. I think the jungle wood goes really good for that, the doors. Because, you know, you can kind of see the outside. That's just me. So now... We're going to put some stairs there. And this is an old trick I learned from a different guy who played Minecraft called Paul Sawyer Jr. That's that. 
if you have a pet peeve with that. Yes, I just broke that. If you have a pet peeve with a star accident placed there, don't worry. It's going to be gone very soon. By the end of the video. So, now we kind of just like start finishing off this whole build. Yeah. And right now I'm kind of just doing like minor changes. Minor things not really needed. Just like, oh, I find it necessary. So, now here's a really cool torch trick. And my torch fell out. You take a torch, an item frame. Oh, hey, they have problems too. You take a torch, an item frame, and a trapdoor. Yes, that's what it's called, right? Yeah, a trapdoor. And what you do is it kind of makes like you put the torch down. Uh, it'll. I'll explain this soon. And it'll be explained as it happens. So here, there's the trap. There's the trapdoor. It re looks really cool because it looks like something's holding the torch. I really hope they don't mess with change the, meta the metadata or something like that. So you put the torch down, and you put the item frame behind the torch, and then you put the trap door inside the item frame. So it looks like there's a little hinge holding the item frame. Now you could just put it up, but that, uh, I don't really like that. So I like it like that. <laughs> That's on, I, to me, that looks pretty good. And I go kind of nuts doing that, and yeah, there, the block, the brick. That's gone. So now what I do is I light up the whole... I put some light on the situation. And yeah, I just go nuts with it. And I've messed with the super secret settings. This house looks pretty good in some of them. I'm not going to tell you which ones, though. I'll leave that up to you to discover. And now I'm just going to take some oak leaves. I believe I'm going to take some oak leaves. Yeah, nope, no. Wait, am I? Am I? Are you? Are you? I think I'm going to. Am I? Huh. Well, Dave got a little bit paler. Terrible throwaway joke. Anyways, so, yes, I'm going to do leaves. And we're going to take some spruce leaves. I personally like spruce leaves. Use whatever type of leaves you, lo you want. But personally, I like spruce leaves. And yes, I don't border it off. I just leave it like that. So now we're going to work on the interior. And if you're going, well, what are you going to do for the interior? A little fireplace and like a little nice setup. So, why is there a bat in my house? Anyways, so what we're going to do here is we're just going to slab that off. I accidentally breathed into the mic again. Stupid me. Not really. So now we're just going to make that brick and we're gonna turn that brick back there i have a screw up i m do that but it look makes it look like it's bulging that's not really a good idea if you're gonna put it at the corner if you're gonna put it just like at a side just to, like solid at a side that's fine i don't know why i sound like i yell but if you're gonna put it just the side that's perfectly fine but when you're like messing with but like when it's at a corner it's a little bit different and i'm actually gonna make this where it's like an open where it's like an open sorry hold on okay i'm back where it's like okay it's an open chimney wow that took a long time so it's gonna be an open chimney wow that hurt okay so it's going to be an open chimney. I, I think they would be cool. You don't really see too many people do an open chimney. Just, uh, I don't. If you guys do, please tell me which, who does so I can get a better idea. I'm going to take those out. Sorry, I had to get some water. I'm going to take those out because I honestly don't need those. So, yes, that was me if you heard it. Okay. So I kind of just make the roof and the roof's gonna get better later but for right now yeah there's your fireplace that's the inside and don't worry it won't light anything else on fire although i haven't checked back into my minecraft to see if i've lit something on fire so i go through the the chimney takes me like 10 minutes i lied it doesn't it takes me about five i don't know i didn't time myself we're at 14 27 minutes right now so we're gonna see when i'm done with the chimney 
so yeah, I go through a few different variants for my chimney. Most of them look cool, but I kind of want one that's very symmetrical. I hope that's the correct word to use. So like, I try a symmetrical look the most of the time, like that, but then it doesn't really add up on the top. Brick's very hard to use. You get that feeling. I feel like cobblestone or wood works better, but wood would light on fire. Unless you had fire tick off. <clears throat> yeah. So, sorry. Long, odd, awkward pause. Thing I'm a bobber stuff. I'm a jigger. I think there was a Dr. Seuss book about that. I don't know. Anyways. Back to what we are doing. So it's now been one whole minute, and oh, never mind. I lied. It didn't take me 15 minutes. It took me a minute. Yeah, it took me a minute to do the whole fire to do that. And yeah, this look. If you're going, what about the roof? There's like a red part. We're getting to the roof right now. And it's I like. I have a theory for this. Is I like this roof. To me, it looks very cool. You can use whatever wood you want. Anything here can be substituted for anything else. You could use quartz. I don't know how that would look. But anything you want to use. I'm just using personally what I find useful. My favorite, like, blocks I don't use, blocks I do use. Stuff like that. So, yes. I'm doing a slab roof. And if you're going, what's the, thing, what's the deal with a slab roof? They take longer. Just, just because kind of just like they take longer because you're you're having to spend time adding slab over slab and yeah and I mean that looks kind of cheesy right there so what I do is I add stuff out and that doesn't look very good I'll fix that later I eventually do fix a lot of this later so, I personally like how the house is going. Yeah, see there. That's where I fixed that. Because I think it looks cooler like that. You can substitute the inside for any any type, anything you want. I was just using that because I thought it looked nice. So I was just using spruce wood. I like spruce wood. It looks cool to me. It's like a darker wood. I also like the dark oak. But, that's all I have to say. Goodbye. I lied to you. I'm not going. Okay. So, yeah, it, it goes up and then takes a slow dip down, which I really like that, that it does that. And I just saw torch particles. That's kind of weird. So, this looks very nice. It complete, took me a day and a half to build. Forget the, that I just said day and a half. Because I, because I finished it by saying time says zero, and all the villagers can run free. So, right about there... Right about where you see my, um, I have a lot of spikes. Where you see right now, it then steeps down, it then slopes down from there. It doesn't go like boom and instantly just like hit and go down. It takes a slow descent. And hold on. Never mind, that has nothing to do with me and what I'm, anything I'm doing. I don't know, it probably has something to do with any, somebody else. Sorry for the awkward silence. So, I pers I like this roof. Tell me what you think of it in the comments. I would like to know. Actually, I s I'm serious. I would. So, yeah, that's where I fix it. That kind of looks odd. So, there we go. And then I add that right there. And like that. And like that. And there we go. And, yes, I did not forget the edges. So, here we are. So, there we go. And that is it. We are done. Ha, ha, ha. Except I lied. We still have to do the interior. You can do the interior how you want. I'm just going to throw out one idea of something you could do. It's just one quick thought. So, I think inside birch wood and gray, I, I'm thinking, I was thinking, gray would work very good. And this is where some banner ideas come in. So, completely get rid of all that and put down...
or whatever you want. To I just thought birch wood to make it look a little bit lighter. I want warning to do so that I won't light my whole floor on fire. Because we're going to just take cobblestone. It's cheap, non expensive. Just take cobblestone and layer it under that. Done. Voila. Boom. Now go nuts with your birch wood. There you are. And don't light anything on fire. OSHA rule number one. I don't even know if that's an OSHA rule. Now, just like some quick, just add this, this, and this. You can put chests wherever you want. I don't, I didn't put any. I was being derpy. Yeah, I was being derpy. So there we go. You can put whatever you want. And this is kind of just like a basic house build. And now I'm going to take a armor stand and a black banner. There we are. And I'm going to put the black banner there, but that spot is soon going to change. There we go. So now I'm going to lay down the gray carpet. Not the red carpet, the gray carpet. And it's really hard to break it because it's like one tile block. It's kind of hard to place. Just for me. And th this one world is where you're going to see all the buildings go. So this may turn into like my own city. And I may just name it Carthopolis or something. And just to give like an example on dyes, you take uh. on whatchamacallit, you take whatever color you want. I breathe into my skin. Uh. And you just like go nuts. I, I can't really figure them out. I didn't really do anything. I know there is a command block that uh. lets you put banners on your head. So like I have a red roundel right there. It's another red roundel. And then I could have a white roundel. And I think you have to put the many things you want in at once. I don't know. But so I thought, okay, I'll just put an oxy daisy. Right? Why not? They're called oxy daisies. So that's a black flower charge in a red roundel. So what I do is I put it right there. And you know, you could put it anywhere you want. And yes, I got rid of it. You do any armor stylization you want, just eh. So plopped on a bed. I mean, you don't really need to put it there. You can put it anywhere you want. So, nope, wrong place. Okay, there we go. Now, like that. Put that right there. That was just an example one. And you could have, like, armor on display if you wanted to. And I put a sword in. You don't have to do that. All this stuff is, the interior and the exterior is optional. You can switch it out with anything you want. That looks pretty cool, though. And, yeah, you can switch it out with anything you want, and this recording is almost come to its end. Dun, dun, dun. So, as we make a water bucket to extinguish any fires, I will tell you, thank you for watching this video if you have watched it. Please like, subscribe, favorite, share it with family, friends, amigos, three amigos, anybody you want. I like that movie. And... Yeah, I guess I'll pretty much see you next time, and that's a water bucket. So, I'll see you guys next time, and goodbye, and I don't know, do any of the things I just said. You don't have to do them, but it helps, sort of, really. And I shall see you all next time. Bye. I paused the video, ha ha ha.